Okay, Lego friends, this is it by Gelly. Time to open up the BrickLink uh, Designer Program Skyline Express. Now, uh, I must report that I could not bring myself to uh, slicing this beautiful um, seal that they have on here. Look at that thing, Skyline Express. I just couldn't do it. Maybe silly. But, uh, I don't know. I just thought, oh, I, I just can't slice through that label. Uh, couldn't do it. Stared at it for a good five minutes, and then I decided to go ahead and get the heat gun. I don't know why, really, because, you know, it's still, the label's not the same. But, it does kind of tack down there again. And if I wanted to, I could, I guess, tape it down there. I just, I just couldn't bring myself to cutting that label. But here we are. I have not seen inside this yet. Oh, by the way, yeah, the outer um, cover is really cool. Check that out. I believe somewhere in there um, is the Skyline Express, or a monorail anyway. Uh, but yeah, you can open this thing up. I probably will. I just don't want to damage the little foldy pieces in there. But yeah, that's a pretty cool thing. So here we go. Kabam. So yeah, I think... Um, oh, check that out. Wonderful. So this looks like... It has spiral instructions in it. Um, you know, now if you get a BrickLink Designer program set, uh, you've got to go online to get your instructions. Check that out. Look at that other um, designer program finalist. They called it the A full designer program. Um, then Lowenstein Castle, the Antique Fire Engine. There's the Skyline Express, Wild West Saloon, Isle of Peril. Let me go in and face the peril. No, it's too perilous. Uh, look at that stuff. Wonderful. That's cool. I have never opened this before. All right, I won't read all that, but that's pretty exciting. Ah, look at that. Cool. Spiral staircase to get up there to the platform. And look at those bags. 1C, huh? 1B. Nice. Beautiful. 2A. Looks like these. I won't have any choice but to cut them open. And that's okay, because we are going to build this thing. 1D. 1A. There we go. The start of it all. Yeah, pretty awesome. Ah, what is this? Exclusive element. A Technic brick, 2x4 with three axle holes with the 60 years pattern. Interesting. Exclusive element. There's a bunch of exclusive elements, I thought, though, in this set. You know, pieces they've never made before. To be or not to be? To see? Ah, oh, there we go. This is one of the things um, important to me because I'm quite sure I'm gonna need a lot more track uh, to do what I want with the monorail. That's what I'm thinking. 2D, there we go. There's some nice straight track there now. Wonderful. 4A. There's the stanchions. Beautiful. Get that thing up in the air. Very nice. I see some printed pieces. Very good. I don't know if we have stickers on this or not. I have no idea. Ah, oh, very nice. Look at that. Designed by Jazzle Craze. A couple little base plates. Actually, those are bricks, really, not base plates, right? Because they've got the receivers for studs on the bottom there. Very cool. And looks like a minifigure there, too. That's good. Always happy to see that. But yeah, look at that. Oh, how cool is that? We got to look at that. All right, out of the way there, Philip. Yeah, look at this, huh? Very good. I, I still say I prefer this over the online um, instructions, but I get it. Some people say, yeah, but when you're doing um, different colors, like brown or dark brown, um, I've heard that the online instructions actually uh, show those better. But this is fantastic. So I can just build it. Uh, straight from the destructions here um, and see how it goes. So I think that's what I'll do, by the way. I think I'll go ahead and just build 
what you see here, then I will work on getting the uh, motors um, or motor in there so I can run this thing. And then, um, then I'll worry about the design that we're going to actually have in the city because in in the city or in town here I really want it to just to go from one end uh, back to the other and I do believe uh, that there is something you can buy with a sensor right that once it passes by and hits that sensor it reverses your motor and runs it the other way so look at that little ticket booths there little cash register really like the spiral staircase that's really cool very nice yep very good boy these instructions are wonderful too really clear really big book spiral is awesome i don't have to bend it all up it is a wonderful thing there's our little platform very good oh that's nice Yep, funky shape there too, huh? And look at that, starting to build their tr build the track there. Very cool. So that is it. You guys got to see it for uh, at least see the one I've got first time um, ever. I don't think I've watched an unboxing on this, although there's other folks that have this um, and show it on YouTube. Um, I just have not seen that. So there, look at that. I think I did watch somebody who motorized it, actually, so that I could figure out, you know, could I do that? And then there's your parts list. Very good. That's really important to me because, of course, I want to go in and buy more of these um, from BrickLink as soon as I get a chance. Cool color guide on the last page there. Very fun. So that's it, my friends. Good look at uh, unboxing the Skyline Express. I am excited. This is my project for this weekend, and I got a nice long three-day weekend um, to work on this thing. Got some other stuff going on this weekend, but I should have this built um, definitely by, uh, by sometime uh, Monday afternoon, I'm hoping. That's the plan. So that's it. Thanks for stopping by. Life's a brick. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. More great stuff coming your way. And we'll catch you on the next video.